Hello everyone, I'm back with another video. In this video, I'll be showing you how to fix a Samsung device which is stuck on boot loop or which is bricked. Now, in this case, I'm using a J7 Pro. Now, let me just turn it on and show you. As you can see, my phone is stuck on boot loop and it's not turning on. Now, to fix this, you will need a PC. In your PC, open the Chrome browser and search for www.sammobile.com and then hit enter. This will take you to the website. Now, on this website, go to the firmware section and then scroll down till you find the browse firmware archive option. Now click on it. This will take you to another page. Now scroll down and enter the model number of your device. The model number of my device is SMJ730GM. As you can see the device is listed over here. Click on it and just hit the search button. Now it will take you to another page where you have to select your country. As you can see I have got the select country option. Click on it and select your country. In my case it's India so I'll select India. Now scroll down and select the latest version of firmware available for your device. In my case Android 9 is the latest version available for my J7 Pro. Now just click on it and it will take you to this page. Now scroll down till you find the download option. As you can see, it says join to download. You have to sign in to their website in order to download the firmware from here. I've already downloaded the firmware, so I need not download it once again. Now go to the location where you have saved the downloaded firmware. As you can see, I've already downloaded the firmware. All you have to do is just right click on it and select the extract to option. This process might take a while, so let me just fast forward it. Now in this folder, we've got all the files that were extracted from the archive. The next step is to enter into download mode on your device. Now let's move on towards a device. All you have to do to enter into download mode on your device is press the power button, the volume down button and the home key at the same time. This will take you to this warning screen. Just ignore it and press the volume up button. Now that we've entered the download mode, let's move on towards our PC. Now here, open the Odin software. Right click on it and then select run as administrator. You may get this warning message. Just ignore it by clicking on OK. Now connect your device with an original USB cable. As you can see, I've got this added message over here. This indicates that my device is connected successfully. Now tick the BL option and select the BL file from the extracted archive. Head on to the location where you saved the extracted archive. Now here select the BL file and click on open. Once the file is loaded, do the same thing to the AP, CP and CSC option. Now while selecting the CSC file from the archive, make sure you select the home CSC file and then click on open. Now as you can see all the files have been loaded successfully. Now just click on start. This process might take a while so let me just fast forward this.
Once you get this pass message, unplug your device and then enter into recovery mode by pressing the power button, the volume up button and the home key at the same time. Once the Samsung logo appears, release the power button. Now once you are into your recovery, scroll down and select the wipe data factory reset option. Click on it and then select yes. This will do a factory reset. Once again, scroll down and wipe the cache partition too. Now reboot your device. The boot up may take up to 10 to 15 minutes. So do not disturb the process. As you can see, my device is booted. Now let me just quickly complete the setup. As you can see, we have a working J7 Pro. Thank you for watching my video guys. If you like the video, please hit the like button and do subscribe to my channel and stay tuned for more upcoming videos of the J7 Pro.